African girl answers. Super. Let me start by showing you my mailing station. Okay. And of course, my novel, Yefon the Red Necklace. And I'm going to show you how I ship. Okay. Shipping out your product to your clients is a very uh, personal experience and uh, I used to be really bad with it. I made mistakes, I lost track in numbers and all that stuff and now I got better. I want to kind of share with you some of the tips that I learned. Here we go. Number one, prep your orders using an order sheet. My order sheet is a very simple sheet that I made myself using Google Documents and it has my client's name, address, how many books they've ordered, and other useful information like the tracking number and so on. This helps me stay really organized so that I don't lose information. Sometimes the clients can also let you know what names they prefer to be called. This makes the experience all the more personal. Number two, stamp your book with a seal. For me, it's all about being authentic. I want my client to know that I took the time to make sure they know this book was not stolen and it came from me. It takes a lot of work. Okay. Number three, add a thank you note, preferably handwritten. Look, there's nothing as touching as your client opening their package and they see a handwritten note from you. I usually like to write it on paper and then transfer it to a beautiful card. You can see the green, cute little orangish cards that I got over there. But look, guys, the struggle though, like picking out what to say, oh my God, is the funniest thing ever. Dear John, you are so kind for supporting me too boring nah 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 my homie john you'll be for real though helping a sister out on the streets though yo 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 <laughs> too rapid cher sean merci beaucoup appelle moi the night is all straight though! I finally got one correct. Yes! Thank you, Jesus! Yes, let's spell check that. I know I'm carry last, okay? And I'm all done! Number four, add a souvenir. Yeah. Number five, check addresses for accuracy. You do not want to make a mistake on the address because that is not polite. Okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. I, I think I got it. Sally the hustler. Super. <laughs> Press the button though, it's not gonna turn green. Let's go in. Oh, wait, what? Oh. Sunny, did you check the time? I don't know why I didn't think about it. it goes at 6 p.m. <laughs> like, I mean, you're so dumb. <laughs> Wait, how come I didn't think about it? Sandy, it goes at 6 p.m. Like, literally, it closed like a few minutes ago. It's okay, I don't want the viewers to know I'm dumb. That's so dumb. Hold on. Do you like do Just accept it, you're dumb. Accept it. I'm basking it. Do we walk like all the way here? Oh, stand there. I can see the sun is kissing your face. <sighs> Just might be the throne we need to make it better. I don't wanna fight. I don't wanna lose. 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 I don
tweet this, Instagram this, Facebook this, share this with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe. It's the red button at the bottom of the video. I'm your host, Sandra Fondufe. You can follow me at Sandra Fondufe with an H on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. I love you guys. You guys are awesome. Thanks for the support. It's been real. And let me know what you want to hear about. And I will tell you. Super. Chris.